morning, Legit Nation. It is a brand new day. It is another time to shine. It is another day to grind. It is another day to show the world what you are made of and what you can do. Welcome to the vlog, guys. If nobody's told you already yet, I love you guys. Jesus loves you guys. Let's make today a very legit day, and I have a feeling a lot of you guys are gonna enjoy the vlog for today. So stay tuned. Let's get into it right now. So this morning, you're probably wondering to yourself, Tim, what do you mean I'm gonna enjoy the vlog today? I enjoy all of your vlogs. Well, that's because today I'm doing something that you guys have been asking for a very, and I mean very long time. This has been very longly anticipated, and I know that it's back to school season, so I was like, hey, I gotta make it for the legit nation. But today, we are going cleat shopping. That is right, something that I know absolutely nothing about. I'm not gonna try to lie to you guys. I'm not gonna try to make it seem like I know everything there is to know about cleats, because really, I don't know anything, and I didn't play soccer in high school or anything like that, but I know a lot of you guys do, so I do want to make entertaining for you videos for you guys. Um, for the past, like, I don't know, a couple of months, you guys have been saying, Tim, show cleats, show cleats, show cleats when I go to Ross and Marshalls, and so I decided, you know what, today I'm going to make a dedicated video for you guys who have wanted to see the cleats because today we are only gonna show the cleats. Uh, we'll probably, we might show some sneakers too if we find some heat, but I got some guy coming with me today and basically he used to work at a soccer store and now he is a soccer coach. So he pretty much knows everything there is to know about soccer and I had to get the best for you guys for the video. So without further ado, we're gonna go meet with him right now and let's get our cleats on, baby. Let's do this. All right, guys, so I just met up with the soccer cleat plug, man. This is my boy, Matt. Oh, it's your boy. <laughs> Shout out to this it. guy. So you coach soccer, right? You coach soccer? I coach a little bit of soccer. I okay. play a little bit of soccer, you know. Okay, all right, so here. we're in Ross right now. We're gonna see what we can find when it comes to cleats, and we're gonna find some deals today, guys. We're gonna find the deals. All right, so I'm already hyped, but we're gonna start off on the smallest section and work our way up. And Matt's gonna tell us pretty much what everything is and if it's fire or not. So first up, we got these like Under Armour ones. Um, Thirty-two dollars. Nope. Not flame. Not flame. We got some D roses in here. Um, these are Adidas brand new. These are forty dollars. Pretty cool colorway. Are those flame? Neon green. Listen. A little bit of alligator print on that. You playing on turf? You need that artificial ground. Okay. I mean, these might get the job done, but okay. you know, they're not flame. How much know? are they though? Are they a steel though? Because I mean, they don't have to be flame as long as they're steel. Twenty four ninety nine. That's not good. Not good. Okay. So how about these perps right here with the orange? Twelve dollars or twenty one dollars. Like the takedown model. So I mean, you're gonna save money, but if you're really trying to ball out there, okay. we got the climacles that didn't make it after all. I don't know why Adidas made those. Got some uh, more cleats on here. Some alpha. Oh, yeah. Tempo. Oh, those are the Henios, man. So those are like the lower, lower model. They ain't gonna okay. get you anywhere if you try to ball. All right. So so far we found trash. So I think so. We're gonna keep looking. Yo. What are these, dude? Bro, those are the Shaq greens, right there. Bro. The olive. Oh my. The the Christmas Shaq Christmas edition. Dude, those look fresh, bro. Those are huge. What are these, bro? These look fresh. I was looking at these. I don't know what these are. Bro, those are like low-key flame. Addy zeros. Bro, they have like a lion on the side of those. These aren't soccer cleats, man. Oh, dude, I just saw that cleat right on the top, man. That's like a football cleat or something. Oh my gosh, no, those are so fresh, though. They're so fresh. We got some fire Westbrook's down here, though. That clean colorway, low top, 15 and a half, though. These are some indoors. I mean, they're good. Dang, We're but, finding some good. But they're indoors, though. That's the thing, they're indoors. So you could either be an outdoor type of person or you could be an indoor type of person. So, which which is cooler though? Indoor or outdoor? Yeah. I'm like what makes you more of a man? Outdoor for sure, baby. All right, Come on. outdoor, team outdoor all the way, baby. New flame coming through, new flame. Guys, I just saw these Tommies and they look so hard, bro. 20, $32, all like knit material on top. Kind of like a white, white kid shoe, but uh, I could rock it, bro. It looks hard. Steals and deals hunting, baby. Steals oh. and deals hunting. What is it? How much I are they? I thought it was 16.1s. These are 22.99. Okay. They got a pair that looks just like this, though. They go for like 250 usually. Wow. That's insane. But, we got some uh, Chris Paul. Uh, yeah, Chris Paul's right here. A real good vibe. He says he's getting a good vibe. Getting a good good vibe. vibes are always good. Yeah, I can feel it. For the tribe. Um, yeah, but honestly, like. Last time I found three hundred and fifty dollars shoes, I think, or how much were they that they were saying two fifty? They were looking at the tech crafts. Those okay. tech crafts are like they run for like three hundred dollars on a good day. Dog, the tech, bro, the cruises 
Are these the Victor Cruises, bro? That is freaking sick. I've wanted a pair of these for a while. They're size 10 for $50, dude. Victor Cruz with his own sneaker line. That's some flame. So these cruises are pretty hard, honestly. The leather quality is... Um, what? <laughs> the leather quality is super sick on these. They feel like almost like a luxurious sneaker. Like, I don't think I've ever felt something like only if they were a little bit bigger these are a size 10 my normal size is 10 and a half so i don't know if these are gonna cut it but honestly the quality of these is sick the oh, boots bro man, dude. for when you're hunting for gators use those oh, nike magis when you're oh, hunting for gators under armor Ooh. bro you wear these on the field oh man, oh, man you're ready to go. <laughs> especially if there's rain bro you're set for life oh, baby, dude, those things. Ooh. Ooh. bro the stan smiths over here like i know this is a cleat edition but they got some pretty cool shoes here those are size 10 and a half. What size are you? I'm a size 12, baby. 12. Big boy over here, man. Yo, this is low key flame, fam. This is so comfortable and light, and it's Tommy. Feels like I'm wearing slides or something. Sneakers can go two ways. Either you can fresh them up with your outfit and make them fresh to death, Tommy Hill figure, or you could be preppy, snobby, rich kid. You know what I'm saying? So, which one are you? That's my question today. Do your homework, kids. Yo, five dollar pants inside of Ross, bro. This is insane. For only five bucks, dude. You could buy a freaking KFC meal for the price that you're gonna get these pants for. You know what I'm saying? Steals. What? Oh, baby. What this is the find of the day, Yo. man. Oh what my is it? god. Yo, what is it? I'm so confused right Yo, now. This is a Yo. FIFA quality soccer ball. Yo. Usually goes for 150. Bro. What's the actual price on this right now? Uh-huh. We need to find the actual bro. price right now. What's the price on this? Bro, I have He's no idea, but that kid no was way. staring at us, so I had to get bro, him in the block. Bro, need okay, he ball. needs to buy this ball for his soccer team, y'all. Wait, well, what, about, what about this one, though? Oh, wait. Oh, no. It's trash. Barcelona for You know what we do with, oh, Barcelona? Barcelona for life. <sighs> I'm scared right now. I'm scared right now. Hey, the futures, though. Those futures. Jordan 11 clickbait. Oh, we need to find the price on these. Dog, we gotta price them? This em? could be the deal of the day, baby. So we need the generic price for that ball right there. $9.99? Bro. $9.99? Bro, he, his first steal ever. Stop this. this. Stop this loss prevention. Before we get the steal, stop the loss prevention. He ain't gonna stop this loss. Y'all just took a loss, Ross. <laughs> Ross boss. Ross took the loss from the Ross boss. Or something like that. $12.99. $12.99. He, I found the price. I found the price right there. Oh my $12.99. We found it, yeah. It was like. Yeah, it was $12.99. My bad, boss. All right, anyways. Yeah, $12.99. The complete soccer steal of the day. Baby, oh my god. Bro, he's hyped. What's up, fam? What's up, bro? What are you buying? Some fire? Yes. Literally? Like my literally fire, bro. Yeah. I like that. Soccer, oh, soccer, active soccer. Tops, baby. Bro, active tops, bro. That's what we've been looking for the whole time. Active tops, man. Uh-oh. Oh, oh that's bro. A t -shirt, baby. Oh, bro, no. just a t-shirt. I wouldn't know that though. <laughs> Barca? I love him, but that ain't. That ain't the fire? Bro, where's the fire at, Ross? Where is your fire at? All blacks? <laughs> New Zealand. These Tiffany Pumas are pretty sick. $26.99. Aren't these the one that David got kicks held up in that eBay commercial? I see you, bro. I see you. All right, so we're about to cash out on these steals and deals, man. I got those Tommy figure shoes for the win, and then he got that 150, 150 for ball 12 for bucks, 12 baby. bucks. Ross Boss in the clutch once again. Here we go. Next up, we're gonna hit up Marshalls and see what they got for the soccer fans. Here we go, baby. Marshalls may have my boy Matt's never been to Marshalls. The Matt of Marshalls. Here we go. Let's check it out. Get some steals. Let's do this. All right, so right here we have some cleats by Nike. I'm not, these are the. Football cleats. Oh, football. How about these? Uh, there's some more cleats over here. These? Oh, they got the oh, they got the rubber bottoms. Oh man, these are all little kids. The rubber bottoms are just for little kids. Yeah, man. This is like this is like when you're like four years old, just starting the sport. Parents are like, okay. Yo, we, need to, we need to bring this kid out. All right. Ooh, they got some Jordan Five slides. Oh, that was pretty clean. There has to be some cleats here, though. My heart just dropped. There's no cleats here. Some ZX flexes, though. Bro, there was like one pair over here. There was like one pair, but they're like for chicks. Dude, it has that little skull on it. These are Hyper Venoms. Is that like a collab? It's Water like Venom? a, it's just the design on it. Like oh, Neymar okay. used to wear these, but yeah, these are just like the, the low end ones. No deals here. Now we gotta find some deals, bro. 
I'm so freaking disappointed that they didn't have nothing at this Marshalls, bro. Like, we, I wanted to find those $250 cleats. Hold Soccer up. steel? Hold up, it's an indoor. It's an indoor casual, bro. That's for soccer? How much are these? $59 for these? Yeah, it's a little bit more expensive than Ross. Man, these are good indoor. It was like a, it was like a casual shoe that they made. Okay. All right, I didn't know that, see? Some Air Maxes down here. 40 bucks. Eh. Yo, what is this? Boy. What did I just this find? This is a USA jersey. But not serious, only is bro? it a USA jersey. Okay. This is the game jersey, baby. These run for 150. Bro. Ooh. This is the real one that they wear on the field, baby. Are you serious, bro? Size small, though. Ooh. $50. Oh. Oh. Dude, so that's like one third of the, of the price. This is the real, real jersey, too. Like, look at that. Feel that, Bro, man. Feel that is that pretty feel. real. That's honestly sick quality, man. This is new, That too, is dude. sick, bro. Dude, that's fire. That's a steal. That's a steal for sure, dude. I didn't think they'd have it. Whoa. Uh, no. Whoa, wait. No, that is a steal. That's a training shirt, but... Usually for $100, going for $39. Not bad at all. Yo, I can totally see you in these, bro. I can totally oh, see you bro, in these. Oh, bro, they my size, baby? Bro. That's all I'm you right there, man. Well, have to that is all you. Man. Ooh. Ooh. That just says, as a soccer coach, that just says respect. You know what I'm saying? I think I gotta try them on now. Confidence, leadership. For them XXL dudes out here, three XL baby. Jordan hold you down, and yes, we do stretch out the sleeves. Twelve dollars, baby. Air. Soccer challenge or what? I'm down. Soccer challenge. <laughs> hey, oh, no, hey, no, no, no. almost, almost. Soccer challenge inside Marshalls, baby. Steals and deals. Boom. Play that music. Maestro. Oh, 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 oh. Looking for the steals. Looking for the steals. Oh. Boy, straight flexing up in this Marshalls, man. That's how we do. Oh, we, we made our way to the women's oh. Yo. My mic straight up fell off my camera. Did I knock it off? <laughs> no. Oh, I was like, oh. Just like fell off. Uh, real Madrid. Not the fake Madrid, bro, but the real one. Ooh. Oh no, this is that. Oh, this is that. It ain't that Adidas, baby. It ain't that oh, Adidas. It's only eight bucks, though. I'm just saying, you know what I'm saying? Walmart edition. That's a pretty fresh fit, though. Pretty fresh fit. Bro, that Savage tee, you know what I'm saying? Straight up Savage. That is pretty sick. I'm not even gonna lie. That is sick. How much do they usually run? Uh, that one, they usually have the price tag right here. Oh, there it is. $8. Eight. Check out. I would, bro, if you're gonna really rock it like a Savage. Oh, you already know. A savage with a pink shirt on. Oh, come on, baby. I'm the ultimate savage, baby. Come on, look at that. Shout out to the homie Matt. Thank you so much, bro, for coming through and showing me what is what when it comes to cleats. He's like trying to increase my cleat knowledge just a little bit because I know that's what you guys want to see and that's what you guys want. So that's what we're going to give you guys. So stay tuned because we're going to get some pretty lit, 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 lit cleats. Lit, lit, lit. Oh my gosh. Lit cleats on the vlog. So stay tuned. Uh, we're going to try to do the Nike outlet soon. And yeah, it's been dope. Thank you for uh, being on the vlog, Matt, and let's continue the day. Yo, so next up, we are popping into Best Buy, baby, because we are about to shoot another $500 challenge. I'm kidding, guys. We're not doing that ever again. No, I'm just kidding. We could do it again, but we're not doing it today. Uh, today, I got to get something very, very, very important. Shout out to the guy in back of me for staring at me. Like, that's how you know you're old if you stare at a vlogger, because you have no idea what they're doing. But like, you know you're young if you're like, <gasps> he's a vlogger, because, you know, you know what's good. So I came in here for something I really, really need, and I've been needing it for a long time. It's very important to me and my family. A dog's purpose. Oh yeah. I'm kidding. Forget that trash. So what is in the bag? What did your boy just cop from Best Buy? So basically what I got today from Best Buy is that your boy got some fire, your boy got some flame. First of all, Joby, I love you, I hate you, I hate that, I need you, but I had to get a brand new Gorilla Pod because Joby's are fantastic, they're amazing, they're great, but the thing about Joby's is that you gotta open the box with your teeth. I'm kidding guys, that is not what I'm talking about, but y'all, Joby is great because they're a tripod and like you can like bend it and you can do whatever with it, you can vlog with it. But why am I opening the box? I can show you guys right here. This is basically the Joby. You can bend it, you can play with it, you can set it down, but the problem with Joby is that sometimes their things get loose and they pop out. I've talked to you guys about this before, and every couple of months you gotta go buy some new Joby material. So basically, I know it might be kind of boring for some of you guys, but if you guys wanna know what I use, this is basically a must need for every vlogger. 
that wants to copy Casey Neistat because it just says Casey all over it. But that's besides the point. I also got a new charger because my my phone charger wanted to play games. So I recommend getting the Apple one though because the other ones, yeah, not so good. So yeah, basically that's basically what we got at Best Buy is we just got some boring items. We got the Joby, we got the iPhone charger, and yeah, that's pretty much it. So right now guys, I just arrived at a barber shop. I'm about to get a fresh cut in right now guys. If you remember last week, my dad cut off all my hair because I told you guys give me 5,000 likes and I'll cut off all my hair. So right now I gotta go get it faded up. I gotta go get it cleaned up. We're gonna try out this new spot called Champs Barbershop and we're gonna see what kind of work they do here. So let's get a cut. I'm the barber with the golden voice. Yeah, 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 I saw that. I was like, why did you say barber with the golden voice? <laughs> I was like, you think? That is why. You think? No. No, you just announced? Yeah. That's pretty cool though, I like that. Yeah. Well, basically, man, I think I'm just gonna like, I wanna grow my hair back out, right? Okay. So I just wanna like fade up the sides and make it look really cool for what I have right now. And just get it edged up and stuff. Other than that, I think we're good. How short of the size? Uh, probably like a half. A uh half? -huh. Yeah. Okay. So in the last clip, my camera died, but yo, we got this fresh cut right here. Shout out to Champs Barbershop. We're definitely going to be back for more fresh cuts. Yo, we're here with my boy, Sam. We're about to hit the gym. It's about to get lit tonight. You guys already know. But uh, I think I heard a knock on the door, bro. Who could be knocking on the door at this hour? Bro. Who is it, bro? Bro, hey, chill, 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 bro. Bro, you don't want to know who it is. I want to know bro. who it is, baby. Yo, come in. What's up? Yo. Oh, okay. I see what's going on here. Bro, I had no idea he was coming through. Okay. Bro, I had no idea. Well, see, the well, thing is... You told me you weren't hanging out with the time. Bro, he hit me up earlier today, and then you hit me up, so I was like, yo, I'm gonna get both of them together so we can make this dope vlog footage for you guys. Yo. Bro, hey, it's cool. It's cool, bro. So chill, bro. You know, you don't like him and stuff, bro, but just calm down, okay, bro? Please, bro, please. Please, just for the vlog, bro. For the vlog. Bro, please. How are you feeling right now? I'm ready to go right now, bro. Bro, hold on, right bro. Now. Let's have a talk with JP. Bro, chill. Bro, you told me you weren't hanging out with him, Tim. Bro, I didn't know. Sam, where? Bro, I swear to you, you better hold me back, bro. I'm not even playing chill, bro. Chill. Nah, bro, chill. Nah, bro, chill. If you're gonna do something, do it, bro. Dude, chill. Nah, you know what? We're gonna take this. Hey, bro, chill, dog. Dang. Okay, we're gonna take this. Nah, we're gonna take this to the gym. We're gonna handle this like men, like you both said, Sam. Stay back, JP. Chill out. We're going to the gym. We're gonna handle this like men, and we'll see what's up from there. Let's go over there right now. All right, so we're here with the two competitors. We're gonna see both sides of the story and we're gonna see what really went down. We're in the gym and we're gonna discuss between the two competitors, JP and Samuel. We're gonna see the side of each story. What is going on with you, JP? All right, guys, so we come in here, we're lifting weights, and then I just heard this guy whispering, saying, bro, you're weak, bro, you're weak, you can't lift. And I told him already, I'm like, bro, don't be talking mess, like, don't say nothing while we lift. We come, we lift, we're men, that's it, you don't have to say anything. And then, the next day, I hear this fool right here, talking mess, texting people, telling people that, our friends, that I can't lift, that I'm not that strong, and then, so then I find out, I come here, I'm looking for him because I knew we were supposed to work out that day and he's not here. And I already told him not to be talking mad. And so didn't he do something where with the co-workers where he told him that you said the fight was off, but in reality he yes. called the fight Okay, off. because we were gonna fight and I was already ready for this fool, and this fool goes and tells everyone I stopped the fight. But this is this BS. He called me, was like, bro. You know, I don't want to do this and this and that. And you know, I was like, all right, you want to wimp out, wimp out, whatever. Okay, you wimp out, that's fine with me, bro. That's fine with me. You want to wimp out, that's fine. And now, 
I told everyone, he's like, nah, bro, I didn't want that. This and that. I'm like, all right, you know what? Man, let's just handle this already. I already told him from the beginning, let's handle this like men, and let's get this over with. All right, all right. Thank you for your side of the story. Now we're coming up to Sam. Sam, bro, you know the deal. What's been going down between you and JP? Nothing much, man. You know what I'm saying? He said he didn't want to fight me. So I, I let everybody know. Hey, chill. Chill, bro. You already had your time. Let Sam talk now. You know what I'm saying? He said he didn't want to fight me, so I let everybody know he didn't want to fight me. Okay. I felt bad for him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I, he wanted to fight me, He's coming up to me, telling me all this and that. I said, you know what? I'm going to go easy on him. I actually feel bad about going into the ring with him. Uh -huh. So I told him, you know what, man? We don't have to fight. We don't have to do this. And he said, okay, that's fine. So to me, I took it as, okay, he's going to see this way. This is the way he's going to get out of it. All right. So I let everybody know he don't want to fight me. I'm ready to go, I'm ready to do it right now. So, when are we gonna have to fight them? Bro, this weekend. This weekend, bro, I already told you I'm ready. All right. Well, I'm ready for you too, bro. You ain't ready though, that's the thing, you call off the fight. Chill, 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 bro, chill. This weekend, exclusive fight. My boy JP, you already know, chill out, chill out, chill out, versus my boy Sam. It's a fight to the death that you don't wanna miss. Stay tuned to the Legit Looks For Life vlogs for more footage. We're coming at you, baby, this weekend. Don't miss out. Let's get it, baby. Beth, hurry up, Beth. Let me in. It's open. Beth, what is this? Open. You drank my muscle milk. A little bit. Beth, really? A this was my muscle milk. <laughs> Who I said you could drink? it for you. <laughs> oh my. Who said you could drink my muscle milk? I did. I bought it. Mm. Can't take this anymore. Testosterone out the roof, man. Out the freaking. Oh my god. Think this is a game? I'm playing with y'all. <laughs> Quit eating my Doritos, dog. My Doritos. All the muscles are so dumb. All right, let's get out of here. We gotta go to the subway. So it's broken? Uh, Dude, so you don't get what you want anymore? I thought it was your way, though. Nah. It's his birthday. Uh, it's all right, man. I know. Dude, you're having a really sucky birthday, bro. You know what? She's gonna make it work just for you. And then I'll be having the uh, fried chicken. With <laughs> We're out of that too. <laughs> out of fried chicken? What? It's my way. Bro, I'm way. sorry that they're Burger out of the King. fried chicken, bro. I heard you were eating fried chicken on the job. Bro, my birthday sucks. Yeah, all right, man, I'll see you later. See you. Legit Nation, what is up, Legit Nation? Thank you guys so much for joining me on another Legit Day. Guys, if you're not a part of the family yet, join the family, hit that subscribe button. We'd love to have you. If nobody's told you yet today, I love you, Jesus loves you. Let's go ahead and get into the word of the day. At the end of these vlogs, we always close up with this. From Psalm 27, seven through eight, it says, hear my voice when I call, Lord. Be merciful to me and answer me. My heart says to you, seek his face. Your face, Lord, I will seek. Guys, sometimes we get so caught up in our daily lives, whether it be work, school, girlfriend, boyfriend, anything that we are doing, and we forget about the name of the Lord Jesus. Guys, I wanna remind you guys today that it doesn't matter how much money you make, how smart you are, how many girlfriends you had, what you did with your life at the end, it's only gonna matter is did you serve Jesus and did you have a personal relationship with Jesus? So guys, I encourage you, if your relationship with God isn't right, get it right right now, because we don't know the day, we don't know the hour, we don't know the minute that Jesus is coming back for his people, so we always gotta be ready. Thank you so much for being a part of my life today, guys. Make sure y'all come back tomorrow for another daily vlog, and until tomorrow, guys, I will see you guys in the next video, Legit Nation. Peace, homies. Stay blessed. We're out of here.